Alrighty, welcome back to the channel. So today I am going to be doing another video where I'm talking about CS skins. However, these are the 10 worst AK skins, in my opinion, that is, in the game. Now, this list is in no particular order, so let's get right into it. So the first skin I have is the AK-47 Rat Rod. Now, do I really need to explain why this skin is here? Like, it's, 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 it's awful, it's shit. Uh, nothing nothing more needs to be said. And the next AK is the AK Unchanted. Now, this is literally just a worse frontside Misty. Like, the frontside Misty's a mediocre skin. This is awful. Like, it has no character to it. In its defense, it's 60p, so you, you get what you pay for. Next, we have the Safari Mesh. Now, the only reason I could personally think of as someone buying this skin is a misclick. Like, there's no way you have willingly bought this skin because you think it looks good. And if you do, and if you have, please seek professional help. Right, so the next skin is the AK-47 Steel Delta. Now, I understand what Valve were going for with this skin, where it's like a Damascus finish. It looks nice. It looks clean. However, there's some things in this world where if you try, you're not necessarily going to succeed in what you've tried to do. And unfortunately, this was one of them. Here we have the Jungle Spray AK. And all I have to say for this skin is, so if you have ever wondered what it's like to wear glasses or how people with glasses see without them on, this skin is it. Just pure blur, nothing else. Like I, I personally, if I took my glasses off, this skin would be white. This skin would just be green. Like I wouldn't be able to see any other color on the skin. They would just be, they'll all combine. Like that's how bad it is. We have now got the Jet Set AK. Now, for the price range, considering it's 200 plus pounds for a vanilla skin, just with a couple stickers on it for different countries. Make it make sense, please. Now, here we have the most expensive skin out of all these, and that is the AK X Ray. I don't think I need to tell anyone that this skin is not worth the price. I feel like that should just be a given. You should know if you have this skin and you have bought this skin with your own money. You have more money than sense, and please speak to an accountant and a therapist. Please, I'm begging you. I, I want you to get help. I want you to get better. This skin, I don't really have a reason to hate it. I just dislike it. And that is the fuel injector. I can't tell you why. I have no reason why. There's just something about this skin that boils my blood for whatever reason. And I just hate it. I just dislike this skin and I couldn't tell you why. Now we have the AK-47 Elite build, probably one of the most popular cheap skins out there for an AK or full stop even. The reason you'd get this skin is because you want to be a minimalist. You want to get a, a cheap minimalistic skin. However, the Elite build looks shit. Just go for an AK slate if you want the minimalistic look. It's sleeker and it's pretty much the same price. You maybe got to spend an extra pound like there's you can afford that now for the last skin i have on this list it might be a little bit controversial so hold your hold your comments back all right i understand this is my opinion so please don't hate me but we have the ak nightwish i just think it looks awful like my niece who is two years old can draw a skin better than this her squiggling on paper is better than this like, it's trying too hard to be flashy and in your face. Like, because of all the pearlescent shit as well, I feel like I'm just getting a migraine. Like, it's, it's, it's a horrible skin to look at. And it's not too expensive. So there are obviously other options you can go for that are so much better than that garbage. So if you have enjoyed this video, please like, comment, subscribe if you want me to make a list of the 10 best AK skins or worst knives or best knives or worst M4 skins and so on and so on. Let me know in the comments and I shall see you in the next one.